They don't have a chair for Skeletor. <laughs> All right, so next subject. All right, so we have a bit of drama going on here. Do you know what I mean? Um, nothing Dango. to laugh about here, but um, drama. So. He got left in the bushes. Squid Games and Squid Games 2. All right, so this guy, the old dude, because I can't pronounce his name, is Oh Young Su. Oh Young Su. Hey, you did it. Good job. Yeah. Man. All right. Gamble. You Do you know how hard it was for me to say that? Ho Young Su. I, th I thought you were going to say Ho I'm a Su. You, the joke went over your head. It's okay. All right. Anyway, look. The joke went over your head, didn't it? It did. And I'm just I said Ho I'm a Su. No? Still not? Okay. Yeah, all right. No. See, look. CLJ gets it. Laughing my ass off. Thank you, CLJ. We don't, we don't get brother. jokes. Sorry. My brother. So, all right. This guy has been arrested or he's been brought up on charges for sexual misconduct back in 2017 where in Korea in Korea where he was up to no good apparently then the charges were dropped but then the the person <coughs> has brought those charges back up again and it he's in a bit of trouble now the guy is 78 is it 78 yeah he's he's 78 years old and he has apologized, but he says just because he's apologizing doesn't mean he did it. I don't know. Yeah. I don't say sorry for shit that I don't. Yeah, he's do, denying but, it. You know, but as I say, um, do you think this could hurt Squid Games 2? Season 2, not 2. You make it sound like it's a sequel. <laughs> Season 2. Oh, yeah. my God. Mr. Mr. Correction. Yeah. What do you think? Sorry, I got to do it. Yeah, I know. Um. Honestly, no, I don't think it's gonna hurt it because he died in season one, so therefore, like, he's not really a central focus. He could be like, What's that fool's name? Like, John Kramer and Saw. Like, you don't really need to see him <laughs> in order to know his influence. I don't know, uh, I don't less than that, to be honest. But then you have to also think about it too. Squid Games is still in the like, it's still not even being produced yet like they're still in the writing stages and everything like that they haven't really yeah, got that it's far out in uh, 20 the end of 23 20 2023 no, and early 2024 no no it's going to they they're, they're the writing is going to go all the way out through the year 2023 and then they're going to start the writing and production is going to go into 2023 and then it's supposed to be out some towards mid to late 2024 that's the mm. that's the idea that they're throwing on the table right now all right yeah I mean, like, do you have any, do you know what's going to happen on the new one? Do you have any updates ah, on that? I'm glad you asked. I have some information if you guys would care to hear. So um, Netflix is obviously taking their time with this, with this show. They're kind of like, they're kind of aiming for a late 2024 release. Uh, they don't want to rush this because we know that Netflix ends up killing a lot of shows when they try to put out multiple seasons and it doesn't do as good as they want to. Um, they're trying to give the director room in order to create because when you really think about it, I believe that the show took 12 years to actually get made. So now that it's actually made and everybody loves the damn show, now it's time for him to sit back and let the creative juices flow. Now the director and the writer was actually upset because he was saying that he regrets killing off some of the characters because he never thought that there was going to be like a season two. <laughs> so he was like, that? damn, I, you said, huh? That's just something caught my eye. Do you see that? The cat jumping around up the top of the side. Anyway. No. Sorry. <laughs> just sorry. I, sorry. Sorry. I'm, I'm, on my, I'm on my notes pages. That's why. Um, so let's see. We do know that the front man is going to be returning, which is the guy in the mask. Uh, the main actor is also going to be back seeking vengeance against the game makers. Uh, we will be also introduced to remember that giant doll, the, the one I was playing, red light, green light. Yeah. We will be introduced to her boyfriend. <laughs> uh, also, the man in the suit. You remember that guy that was slapping the shit out of him at the train station? Yeah. He's going to be back as well. Um, hopefully, he'll be slapping some more people. Um, also, the creators were talking about that they want this to be more of a global thing. So, remember, they were talking about how the Squid Game thing wasn't only in Korea. It was, like, going on all over the world. Yeah. So, they were saying that there's a possibility that – because the writer specifically said they want to appeal more to a global audience because the show has now shown, you know, the qualities to be global and then everybody in the world loves it. So, now they're going to probably – Give us a little bit more about how Squid Games is played in maybe other countries. That's a possibility. 
Um, also, da, 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 the creator also, re- yeah, I already said that. And yeah, that's all I got so far. Well, I actually love the Squid Games. I don't think any of this will hurt it because even by the time that Squid Games does come out, he's already not dead anyway. And everyone will have forgotten by this by then. So, you know, it's not central characters. So I don't, I'm looking forward to the Squid Games. I hope they, it's hard because I, as much as I want them to keep the essence of the first season, I don't want it to be exactly the same. I don't want it just to see another game like more people. I want to. Be- I think it's gonna be it's gonna be a revenge story. I just don't want it to be like Hunger Games, where it's like, oh, all these Squid Games winners from previous seasons. You guys are gonna all come together. You guys are gonna compete with each other. A, a, a bigger Squid Games thing. I think yeah, that'll be a cheap way to go repeat, out about it. Rinse and repeat. And but I don't want to change it too much. Either keep something. But I'm still looking essence. forward to it anyway. But I mean. That's all I have. But what do you guys think? So for people who are watching this later, what do you think? Do you think he's in trouble? Do you think this will hurt the Squid Games? Let us know in the comments below. Like and subscribe. I didn't, I, I didn't, I didn't say that. That's all I have to say. Sorry. You're going to be sleeping in the bushes, okay? And that's all I have to say. But for you guys in the chat, do you looking forward to it? Do you care? Is this going to bother you? Is it going to stop you from wanting to watch Squid Games Season 2? Let us know what we got. You didn't let me say it. That was all I had to say. I thought you said it like three times. No, I didn't say that. See, look, see what I'm saying? That connection ain't there. Um, nah, but I, I don't I don't think it's gonna affect it, to be honest with you, because like I say, he's gonna be dead. He's dead, it's not gonna affect it. And then on top of that, it's not like he's actually been convicted of the crime yet. Once he's been once he's been convicted, like, pro, like prosecuted and convicted, that's something different. Right now, it's just allegations and However, they choose to go forward with it is however they choose to go forward with it. So, yeah. Uh, let's see. Let's go. Now we can go through some comments. And that's all I got to say about that. I swear you said that. I'm going to find that. Go ahead. Find it. Clip it. It I doesn't exist. It. All right. Let's see. Uh, is it single from a very similar to Banda, Banda being the joke? Uh, let's see. This one is still explaining who the hell Elder Barge is. That's funny as hell. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm here all night. Please tip your waitress. CLJ is a fool. Uh, I feel like it had a very mysterious feel to it, like a modern day loss. So here's the thing about it, though. You you guys cannot underestimate the power of Korean writers. They know how to write revenge shit, and they know how to write movies like unlike anybody else. I find so much enjoyment in watching like Korean movies because they're way of approaching a story is so much different from like American writers and things like that. I enjoy it a lot. Uh, Hannah says, uh, Squid Games, the bus slap. <laughs> that should be funny. Uh, really excited for the second season. What do you guys think of the separate reality show they're releasing? Oh yeah. I heard about that. The reality show, like people are actually going to be like doing Squid Game shit. So I really? guess it's all right. Yeah. Yeah. yeah they're going to do no, that that's been in, that's already been announced. Like they're gonna actually av- actually have a game show, a Squid Games game show. Okay. But I wonder if people are gonna get shot with paintball guns. That'll be tight. That'll be dope as hell. Like if you lose, you get lit up with a paintball gun, and then they gotta throw you in a little pink casket and carry you away. That'll be tight. Or a tug of war uh, on top of a, a really tall building. Let's see. Uh, what the fuck? Not heard about a reality show? Yeah, it exists. Uh, reality show that's new, yeah. They do, they just they announced it like last year. Um, yeah, they are doing a real version of the show, no deaths, obviously. Damn, <laughs> where can I audition? I don't have it all. And you know what? I actually saw something about auditions too. That's the crazy part. Uh, Koreans owns, yeah, dude. I'm telling you, Korean movies, like if you watch I Saw the Devil, Old Boy, uh. Memoirs of a Murder. Uh, what's the other one? Um, damn, dude, the one, uh, The Wailing. That's an amazing movie, dude. I'm telling you. Oh yeah, you saw The Wailing. Did I? I made you watch it. That was good. Yeah, yeah exactly. Boy, Sympathy for good. Mr. Vengeance. Uh, Mrs. Vengeance. Like those are all you really amazing. Watch it. If you like Korean subtitles, which I don't, but. Sometimes you mean you don't like work. subtitles? Don't say Korean subtitles. You make it seem like right, you're looking no, at. Right, I don't like subtitles because I hate reading a movie. I'm trying to watch and read, and I'm terrible at reading. So, you know, it does my head in. But when I do, and you 
get a good one sometimes it's really good and the whaling was one of those different can you read that can you read that comment right there for me it says Doughboy is so good looking i don't know how come he isn't a millionaire already no wonder you don't like to read subtitles you can't read for shit <laughs> not really read it the way i read it, it says here uh, i saw the devil i saw the devil was amazing thank you davy yes I recommended him to watch. I saw the devil. Yo, your your cameras. Oh, there it goes. I was like, your camera blurred out. I don't know why, but now you're good now. Um, yeah. So there you go. Subtitles you get to. Parasite was also epic. Yes, Parasite was amazing. That was another one. Parasite was, yeah, was amazing. Good. And this is and this is gonna segue into our next topic. So go, did you already uh -oh. shuffle us out? See you all soon, you royal boobs. I can't wait. <laughs> mm -hmm.